questions should you not ask a professor during office hours? <laughs> well, uh, actually, I've never been, I've not been to office hours too much myself. But yeah, like sometimes people, what they do is they, you know, submit their assignments or submit their projects and they don't get the grades that they expect and they go to professor complaining about it that, you know, what you can go and do is ask for feedback. You cannot go and ask him to change your grade. So you have, you have to know they all are friendly, they are very accommodating, but there is still a line between a student and a professor. So you have to keep in mind when you go approach them, you keep that in your mind. So uh, please don't, don't say like, hey, hey, pro, why, why I got B? It's not fair. I did my best. That doesn't work. Never. And don't say pro, please. That is a little bit tricky um, because uh, it's a very casual atmosphere a lot of times. You know, this is part of uh, U.S. culture in a way. It can be very, very casual. Uh, but your professor is still your faculty member. They are not just your buddy. They're not just your friend. So how do you know how to address your professor? Uh, I would say, you know, you call them, unless they have expressed otherwise, which has rarely been the case and I'm uncomfortable with it, you call them doctor or professor, whatever their last name is. And I always do that via email too, not just in person. Um, try to be as professional as you can. Um, like I said, get to know them, and other people have said get to know them. You're paying for them to be at office hours, for example, right? So they're your experts, that's your time to come and ask them questions. Um, but I think always come with respect, um, maybe even some understanding of what their specialty is and, and how they can help you, that's always good. Having some sense of, um, you know, if you're approaching someone, for example, to be on your thesis committee, in some cases, professors, at least in my program, will push back and they might say no to you the first time and then you have to, on some level, defend whatever your research is, whatever your interests are, and they respect that. So come you know, with ideas, come with, with some preparation and you'll do wonderfully well.